What's up everybody? Nice to see you again. Look at the Arsenal squad guys. Doesn't it look juicy? It could be juicier, of course, and it's gonna be. As you can see here, Jesus, spot on. He's not gonna do anything with him. Martinelli, what can you do with him? Re Declan Rice, maybe if it's gonna come another evolution, maybe I can do something with him. Trossard, I didn't complete this budding sword uh, evolution with him, so it's 83. Maybe he's gonna go up. And Fabio Vieira, Vieira is in this moment in a revolution. But I paused him because I'm gonna build Cedric. And Cedric, Cedric Suarez, from the beginning, he is 73. So what I have been doing with him is like I put like a rock evolution with him. So he gained two overall. He got up to 75 and from 75 I did start the growing spurt with him but let's get back to that let's go through the team Gabriel I could could put an evolution on him and I'm gonna do that and Saliba and Harvard Towers is an SPC Saliba is a, a, a complete card I'm, I'm telling you that look at Saliba you know in the back line look at this he's got the jockey intercept place type plus anticipate the bruiser he likes slide tackle but i don't use slide tackle that a lot block could be there but if i could choose he's good and also saka so let's look upon these three players at the at and in the evolution part guys so we're gonna see here you know Look at Cedric Suarez, he's gonna be 88 when he is complete. Look at his car, defensive is gonna be 91. The pacey part is 76 and it's not good, but I have hold him back and my, my other fullback at attacking as in Harvard, so it doesn't matter. And PlayStation Plus, dead ball. It's gonna be crucial. Look at this part now. Defending, defensive awareness 87. It's good. Inter in in interceptions 92. I was talking there. I don't know why. I got nervous or something when I see it, this car because this car is going to be lethal. I'm telling you. It's got good passing, quite good dribbling, you know. So he's going to be really, really good for me in the back line when he's completed, you know. Okay. Wait, first of all, look. We're gonna have Fabio Vieira at 85 when he is completed. You know, his play style is not, he's gonna be the physical part, quick step. He's got the travel acrobatic, you know. Dribbling, shooting, passing is decent. His pace could be a little bit more, right? But he's gonna be a super sub in the end. Why? Because, of course, I have to use Erdegaard when I'm playing with Arsenal. And Erdegaard is not in the team right now. But let's go here. Okay, guys, let's look at this. Growing spurt. I could use here now, guys. Look at this. This is another surprise for you, okay? I did go on and bought Kivior. Should I do him and complete him and make him 87? The f Should I do that? He's also going to have playstyle plus dead ball. His defensive part is going to be slide tackle and block. He's going to have the technical part, so it's going to pass. Defending 86, 87 at the physical part as a center defender. I don't know, guys. What do you think? Let me know in the comments, you know? Or should I? Let me show you. Patrick who? Should I complete Gabriel here? And he is gonna actually if you look upon it he's gonna have the defensive part 85 when he's completed and he got the block and the bruiser i don't know guys maybe i should complete kivior and, and have him there you know should i do that but the good thing here is like if you look upon this uh, evolution you can see that it is positioning cdm so i could use him as a cdm should i do that or not his dribbling part because if he's a central defender, you know, look at this ribbon part. Agility 58, balance 42. Should I use him as a CDM? I don't think so. I don't think so. But let me know in the comments so I know. So the thing is that we have to go on and buy Erdegaard, of course. And we, let's go back to the squad because it's going to be packed with highlights as usual. And if you are new to this channel, this is a no coins deal. We don't put any coins into the team. 
So it's pure gameplay and this is one of the teams but if you look upon my teams earlier and you know that I got quite a decent team. 4 triple 2 one formation, okay. Gabriel Jesus, Martinelli, Saka there, of course. Trossard is gonna be the guy here as we speak. Declan Rice, of course, here, cutting passing lanes, be the big guy, stocky guy in the middle. Fabio Vieira here, come from left with his Trevela. It's gonna be changed, Erdogan is gonna have that position. Here you have Harvards here, the full back attacker one. And this is gonna be, come back on defense all the time. Stay back while attacking, I'm sorry. And Saliba and Gabriel, or maybe Kivio. So we have to buy Erdogan, right? Erdogan and maybe Kivio here. I don't know, Kivio is, Kivir is better fit if you look upon the uh, if you look upon the stats. But Gabriel is the, the the man to play in Arsenal, of course, if you're an Arsenal fan. So, as you can see, Cedric is really close now to be completed. I I don't have uh, I think I have three more games to do. But what I have I been doing? We're gonna see in the highlights. This is my pro team, okay, guys. I did play with him, and I have played with him since he was 73 here. And he did quite decent, you know. Kolomani is back in the team. He, she, he is struggling with Gabriel Jesus for the for the for the part here. And Sterling, Sterling is really, really, really awesome. I'm telling you that you're gonna see in the highlights. And I did put Bellingham here instead of Tushamini. What happened when I put Bellingham here is that uh, the speed in the game, even though I don't play that pace with this team, it, it got up a little bit, you know, he stepped up a little bit. And also he got the relentless pl playstyle plus, you know, so he, he, he is there, you know, he's, he's crazy as a CDM. But guys, let's go to the uh, highlights, see you there. Okay guys, as you can see, Harvest did score his first goal. And this highlight, guys, is going to be packed with the Winter Cup, the draft, uh, and division rivals. So, so you know. Okay, Martinelli here, you know, he's struggling for the spot in, in the pro team. You know, look at this through pass from my guy Mondrich. And since I play with the Evolution team, you know, a bit, and, and since I play with the Arsenal team, when I play with these guys, my original team, look at Mbappe. It's easy to play with them out from nowhere. You know, look at that shot 124 kilometers an hour. Really crazy. And here you have Sterling. He can pass, he can dribble, he, he, he can defend. No, he cannot defend that good. But see what Martinelli can do. I have some highlights here. Yeah, funny highlights. Look here what he can do, this guy. Up in the air and he puts it up for himself and he puts it down look sterling do complete him his version in ice please do it and here see cedric boom up to 75 let's go right straight back into the game okay look at his animation he makes it look so easy you know sterling that's why i put some of these highlights into the game his pass his first touch, you see there, his passing, so smooth. Go, just, just complete him because it's really going to be overpowered for you. Okay, this is the Versus Cup uh, ice, okay? And who do I got in my team? Look here. I got Pele. You can have one low player, and I, and I do have Pele in 96, so of course I'm going to use Pele. It was so funny. Can you imagine having Pele in your team? Poof, I would be lethal. I should go on and buy some coins, but that would not be according to, to, to this channel. So I'm not going to do that, but I really want to do that when I see this. And also, it's very good if you play this Versus Cup. Do it because you're going to have the experience point that you need, guys. So, so it's really good for you to do it. Okay. And as we as you can see, you know, here you have Bompar Store, you have the Pele, you have Sterling. Look at this animation. Look what he can do. So easy. Back to my guy Mbappe and back to the guy Modric. Okay guys, you, you see how easy it is to play with these guys. You know, it's 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 quite different. That really nice through pass to my guy Pele. You know, and Pele, look Modric now. 
Oh my god, I'm telling you, Modric, he is gonna play in the pro team forever. I'm telling you that he is that guy for me, you know. Him and Mbappe, look at Mbappe, what he can do. He can pass us through, you know, pass through. Sorry for my English there. So, so the versus cup when I when I, when I played it, you know, when I had Pele, I'm telling you guys, I was dribbling, I was dribbling, I was dribbling with him. It was so funny, you know. So in this episode, in this highlight, you're gonna see really nice gameplay, you know, a smoothness gameplay. Okay, look what he can do there. Easy one, easy goal. It's so funny when you have that player in your team, but if you just have that player in your team, if you, if you just go and buy these players in your team, it's not going to be funny these games when you be, when you be able to, to, to play with them. For example, in the Versus Cup when you can use one lone player or, uh, yeah, only in this friendlies actually, or in the draft game. And the draft games, guys, it's really good to play draft games. Why? Because of the objectives? No, because you can. That is a perfect time to try out all these fancy players. You see, Cedric here, he's really smooth on the ball. And he's 75, you know, he's still playing in the rivals with some heavy dudes, guys. Heavy dudes. Okay, you can see here Mbappe. I can do whatever with Mbappe. You know, I, 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 he, he is so overpowered. I already have the best player in the game, you know. 96 Pele, okay, he is really good. Okay, Ronaldinho, I know what you're gonna tell me before I even say it, you know. Of course, these guys are the OP guys, but of all the actual players, you know what I mean, the player who play today, not the icons. You see, Cedric? Really good, you know. He is in this team and he's doing it, you know. It's funny, it's funny to play with him too. You see, you see Sterling, what he can do? Crazy, crazy good player. I'm telling you that. I, I really felt it when I put Bellingham into the game. Uh, before uh, before Tushamani, it really helped me. Look now, the fake shot reset. Fake shot reset. It's like you do the circle, the X, and the circle, the X. Click, 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 click. Try to do that sometimes. That was a fake shot reset. I have heard about the croquet that reset. I did it the last um, the last episode. If you're gonna look upon it, too, and you can do the fake shot reset too. These guys, these two guys upstairs, is gonna be my guys. Look, look what he can do. So easy. He makes it look so easy. So Sterling and Mbappe in the pro team, they are gonna be there. There you have the rage quit. They are gonna be there, of course. So. My problem, issue, whatever you like to call it right now, is should I have him, Kulumuani there right now, or Martinelli? And also in the back of, of, of these guys, I do have Gabriel Jesus too, but it's, it's about these two guys before, before Gabriel Jesus, I'm going to be honest with you. So that, that is my problem. I have switched them around, you know, it felt like, oh, who, who should I play with in the st startup? I don't know, you know, it's different because both of them, you can see, can do amazing things in the team. Kolomani there, two Havertz, and look now what Sterling can do. Okay, he have the ball here. He's dribbling a bit, there you go, smooth beer side of them the trickster makes him move like he in ain't no thing you can see there bam shown into the box between them and boom he did not score but Luka Modric he will score with his Travella playstyle plus so that is my luxury problem that I got you know and Bon Pastor has been a, a, a crazy player for me there you know she nobody can take her spot Besides one player, maybe in that spot, it looks a bit similar like her. It's Olga Carmona when she's gonna have Pep Legacy and become overall 90. I'm gonna show you in the next episode, guys. Okay, so in the next episode, I'm, go I'm gonna show you that. And in, in to the next episode, I'm gonna be showing you some really, really nice gameplays from the Arsenal team. Okay. Drop a like, subscribe, I see you guys.